Coming up in this video. People have to pay. Pay now. Uh -huh. First enclosure, which is the giant sea otter. Well, hello, my fine and beautiful people. I'm Hang Games, and welcome to a new zoo. And oh my freaking god, I'm going to make this my most beautiful zoo. We are going to build a aquatic zoo. Yes, uh, I'm doing this in franchise mode, uh, as I've announced. Uh, I, I wanted to do another. Um, franchise zoo uh, the colton family zoo was very fun to do uh, and you guys also liked it very much so i thought we start off with another franchise zoo and it's going to be a sort of danish style um uh, scandinavian type aquatic zoo with only aquatic animals uh but uh, it could be uh, penguins, it could be sea uh, seals, uh, all that sort of jazz rolled into one, uh, well, uh, not a very big zoo, I don't think it's going to become, but a very fine and beautiful looking park. So this is the main entrance. Um, uh, oh, um, excuse me. A little gassy today. Uh, so we have here a parking lot, uh, which I, I, uh, I'm, I'm going to uh, uh, make it all neat and uh, tidy. But first, I need the money, of course. Yes, you people have to pay. Pay now. Um, so here we have the main entrance, uh, which I have some ATMs, and I'm going to put some other things. I'm going to experiment with the... Um, uh, the gift uh, uh, shop uh, thingy, uh, uh, which we have an update. Oh dear, the inspector's here. Doesn't she look lovely? Yes. Uh, so here I'm going to make a uh, entrance to the real zoo. Uh, I uh, for um, uh, yeah. For some reasons, I've just uh, played, uh, placed this here. But I'm going to make it all in the style of this uh, sort of Danish uh, atmosphere. And then uh, you can go over here to a little walkway under the tree. Because it's, oh, it's, it's very foresty. And then you go down here. And then we have the first enclosure, which is the giant sea otter. Uh, I have to. Uh, I've been playing this uh, for a while, building it, and they already had babas. Uh, but the room was a bit uh, cramped. Uh, because for a giant otter, they need a bloody amount of space. I mean, will you look at this? This. This is what two southern giant otters need. Oh, it's going to be dramatic. No, it's not going to be. Uh, this is a section of the exhibit which I just just finished uh, because it was still too uh, small for my otters. Uh, so I have to make this a little bit more beautiful. But I, I thought this is a sort of a secondary habitat uh, uh, for feeding uh, uh, when uh, the zookeepers are going to clean the real exhibit, all that sort of thing, you know. Uh, then we have a small shelter, which also uh, we have to make a little bit more neat and tidy. And there they are, the little cuties lying down. Ooh. Oh, uh -huh. oh, gorgeous. This game is amazing. Uh, we have Paloma, una Paloma Blanca. <laughs> uh, and we have a temperate rock. No, we have, we have Miguel. Miguel from Spain is the giant there. Oh, dear. 
So it's going to be one of that episodes. Yes, I'm afraid it is. Uh, so I've made a uh, area which they can swim and which the guests can see them swim. Uh, I have to put these rocks all the way down. Ma oh dear. Maybe I shall do that now. So it looks a little bit more neat and more realistic. Uh, let's put you up, put you up, uh, wait, ah, all right, well, it looks fine, it looks fine for now, um, so we have a little pier here, some, uh, something, uh, we have a little, little stairway, uh, to the water, and then we have a whole area of a play thingy with bubbles, and a nice ball, and a little, little bit of foliage, and a statue. I thought I'd place a statue in the uh, enclosure. Uh, this is the first time I've done it, and well, well, I, I think it's, it's, it could work. It could work. Um, and we have a little statue here. I haven't placed any uh, ooh, information thingy. Let's uh, quickly... Quickly put one down, very quickly, um, and then we are going to make a, uh, well, a more bit nicer. But then the guest will know what they'll be looking at. Uh, so yes, this is the first animal in the aquatic zoo. Um, really fond of this whole vibe. It's giving out. Uh, you can see them swim, but you can also see them play around in the background. And then they have a little secluded area over here with their own fairy pond. And then we I, I, I was busy on this a sort of a Danish village uh, uh, where all the shops are and that sort of thing. And then we are going to um, uh, beautify this, the old staff area. Which also I'm going to make a, a, a loading bay, all that sort of jazz. Uh, so yes, this is the first update, the first episode on the new aquatic zoo. Uh, oh, I'm really looking forward to to building in the zoo and make it all neat and tidy and placing more watery animals and see them play around and all that sort of thing. But for now. I hope you've enjoyed this video and I will see you, you cuties, in the next one. Goodbye.